Let's meet an interesting mouse today. This is a computer mouse. This is also known as an optical mouse because it tracks location with the help of a ray of light. Typically, every mouse will have three buttons, left, right and middle. You can press these buttons like this. It is known as click. If you press left button, it is left click. If you press right button, it is right click. You can also press middle button. But interestingly, this is not just a simple button, but it is a wheel that you can move up or down. Now, how to hold this mouse? As you know, this mouse will never run off your hand. Hence, hold this mouse lightly. Just place your hand comfortably and uh, place your left finger on the left mouse button and middle finger on the right button and hold it. Now you can move this mouse left or right. As you know mouse is a input device. You will, this mouse whenever it is moved signals will be transferred to your computer. If your computer is supporting graphical user interface you can do lots of manipulations using mouse. Now if I move my mouse towards left this cursor this white arrow on the screen will also move towards left. If I move my mouse towards right this arrow on the screen will also move towards right. Similarly I can move my arrow up or down by moving my mouse up or down. Now let's move towards items on my desk. This is called as desktop. This area is desktop. There are certain items which I can move. Similar to your desk you can move items on your desktop also. I will what I need to do if I want to select an item I will just move on an item and click. Clicking is selection. If I want to uh, move this item I need to click and hold. I have clicked and hold, held my mouse left button and if I move the mouse now as you can see I can drag the item. Where I want I can place the item. I will leave here. That is called as drop. What I am doing? Dragging the item and dropping it. So this is called as drag and drop. Now let's move towards the start button. This is called as start button or windows button. If you click you will get lots of options and you will get a long list of applications in your computer. As you can guess this is a long list indicated by this tiny rectangle. We are here in this long list. So what I am doing? I am scrolling with the help of drag and drop. How? I will be clicking this uh, tiny rectangle like this and I will be moving my mouse. Where I want, I will leave. That is drop. So let me do that once again. I will click here and uh, drag and I will drop here like this. Also, you can uh, scroll using this scroll wheel by moving this scroll wheel. What happens if I scroll like this? If you move down, move the wheel down, it will be moving down. If you move up, you will be scrolling upwards. Now what happens if you right click? Let's try with this item. This is application called camera. I will right click on it. You will get more options. Let me try with the, let's say, this item. If I right click, I will get few more items. So, these are some additional uh, uh, options. This is known as a context menu for particular item, which are uh, useful to do some additional actions with the item. Now, let's see what is the use of middle button click. So, you can see this middle button and our mouse cursor is here. As you can see, this is a pretty long list of things. So, this is a long web page. 
if i want to scroll easily what i can do is i can click this middle button if you click middle button you will get a special icon like this now if you move your mouse towards down your document or web page will start moving towards down if you move more down it will move faster now if you want to move upwards you can just move little upward document will scroll it will start scrolling slowly if you want to scroll faster just move it fast move it more upward so i hope you have understood that this uh, middle buttons use will scroll like this like this if you want to pause just move to the middle if you want to come out of this scrolling mode just click outside yeah you are back to normal mode so what you can do with your mouse you can move your mouse click click right click you can uh, click and drag and drop that is clicking holding and dropping somewhere and also you can uh, scroll using scroll wheel or using the scroll mode scroll lock thank you for watching happy learning